warm, hasn't it? It's so mild out there, Felicity, yes. First thing this morning, for some of us, temperatures were around 15 degrees Celsius, which is 59 degrees Fahrenheit. Certainly a good morning for a dry with a blustery but mild southwesterly wind. And if I'm honest, a bit more blue sky than we were expecting. Now, this afternoon, there will be a lot of cloud around, and the thickest of that is producing a bit of rain and drizzle in places. But for many of us, it'll be dry, and there are signs that the cloud will thin and break at times to allow a bit of afternoon brightness and sunshine in places too. Now, temperatures staying around 15 or 16 degrees Celsius but we can't rule out a 17 in some spots which is 63 degrees Fahrenheit as I keep saying that's way above the average 8 degrees Celsius we should be seeing at this time of year and the winds will stay on the blustery side from the southwest gusting 30 to 35 miles per hour at times so overnight tonight again a lot of cloud a bit of light rain and drizzle out of the thickest but for most of us a dry night with a few clear intervals and then this very narrow band of rain starting to push in from the west towards morning and some of this really could be on the heavy side. Now temperatures again tonight for many of us staying in double figures so anything between about 12 or 11 to 13 degrees Celsius and we hold on to those blustery southwesterlies. So this rain is associated with this weather front which will rattle through very quickly during tomorrow morning. So this brief spell of wet weather racing across the region and then I think for much of New Year's Eve a lot of fine and dry weather with the cloud hopefully thinning and breaking to allow some decent spells of brightness or at least some sunny spells and uh, temperatures again around 15 or 16 degrees Celsius and yet again we hold on to those southwesterlies potentially gusting 30 to 35 miles per hour. So New Year's Eve night looks like it'll be largely dry for any outside celebrations perhaps a bit of drizzle and then New Year's Day now it stays unseasonably mild with highs of around 16 degrees Celsius but it does now look like although we'll have some dry weather to start and finish the day around the middle of the day we could have a little bit of rain it's a narrow band that is expected to move through which could produce just a couple of millimeters in places and then on Sunday well we're not sure about the timings of the rain on Sunday but again it could be first and last thing with a dry spell in between and then on Monday as it stands it looks like an area of rain will stay to the south of us so Monday is looking dry but those temperatures starting to come down and from Tuesday the winds round to the northwest so temperatures much closer to average around seven or eight degrees Celsius and after some very mild nights I think come Tuesday and Wednesday night the return of frost.